Now we're taking a look at arguably the most talented player in the draft, Memphis 7 one center James Wiseman. He's a special talent and one that if he stays healthy, you can build your franchise around. He impacts the game in so many ways, many of which won't show up in a box score. Offensively, he's most dangerous at pick and roll and pick and pop sets where he can finish at the rim or shoot his improving but solid mid-range jumper. He's also an elite offensive rebounder, so he will save you possessions and score off putbacks. Defensively, he's a great rim protector, has great range. He can cover a lot of ground and contest shooters and run back into the lane to protect the basket and is capable of defending guards, wings out on the perimeter. Let's take a look at Wiseman in action. Wiseman sets up on the left elbow and sets the screen for Memphis Lester Quinones. Wiseman then runs down to the right block setting a screen for Boogie Ellis. He turns and seals his man on the block. Ellis receives a pass from, from Quinones and throws an overhead pass to Wiseman in the post who scores easily inside. One thing that makes Wiseman special is his offensive rebounding. Here Boogie Ellis shoots a three and Wiseman elevates the dunk on the miss. Wiseman is what you call a live body. Someone that's hard to keep a body on and keep off the boards. Tyler Harris shoots a three. Wiseman fights off two South Carolina State defenders for the offensive rebound and passes back out to Alex Lomax to reset the offense. Wiseman goes back to the left block. He makes eye contact with Lomax, recognizing that South Carolina State sitting in a 2-3 zone has lost sight of him. Wiseman gets behind the zone, and Lomax throws a lot to Wiseman for the two-hand dunk. Presses and Chowan knocks the ball loose from Armani Hill, and Damian Ball recovers the ball. Wiseman runs from inside the paint on the opposite end of the court, beating everyone down the floor. Ball finds him in stride, and Wiseman punches it home. These are the plays that scream David Robinson. It's rare to see seven-footers run the floor with the speed of a guard, but that's one of Wiseman's strengths, which gives him a huge advantage over most big men. DJ Jeffries receives the dribble handoff from Jalen Hardaway as Wiseman flashes to the top of the circle to set a screen on South Carolina State into Monty Applewhite, who is defending Jeffries. Jeffries drives left and is cut off by the Lafayette Snow, who left Wiseman to stop his drive. Jeffries passes to Wiseman, rolling to the basket, who finishes with a vicious two-hand dunk. Beautiful play to maximize Wiseman's off-ball impact. Stone had to make a decision. Either give up a bucket to Jeffries, or watch Wiseman score inside. Memphis literally runs the same exact play again, taking advantage of the slow rotations and lack of adjustments from South Carolina State defensively. And again, it ends with Jeffries coming off a screen from Wiseman, lobbing it to Wiseman for a two-hand flush. Wiseman is defending Applewhite out on the perimeter. Applewhite passes it to Tariq Simmons and looks to screen Boogie Ellis. Memphis switches and Wiseman is now out defending Simmons. Simmons drives right on Wiseman, but Wiseman moves his feet and blocks his shot. This is something that is mandatory in the league, being able to defend the guards out of pick and roll sets, and Wiseman has the quickness and length to do so effectively. Wiseman is defending Applewhite close to the elbow. Applewhite runs inside to set a screen for Jamari Etienne who's running out for a three-point attempt. Boogie Ellis gets delayed by the screen, so Wiseman leaves Applewhite and runs out to contest it, then forcing a tougher three-point attempt. Wiseman then releases. Memphis pressure in the gathers the miss, and passes up ahead to a spring Wiseman who lays it in. Wiseman's range defensively is elite. David Bottenberg dribbles up the floor and has the ball knocked loose by Lomax. Lance Thomas gathers the loose ball and passes ahead to Wiseman, who dribbles through two South Carolina State defenders and lays it in, showing he can make plays off the bounce and isn't solely relying on teammates to set him up for scoring opportunities. Wiseman has all of the tools to be the top pick in the NBA draft and a future building block for any franchise. He thrives on both ends already, which is rare for young bigs. I also believe you can't pigeonhole him into being a traditional big. He's very versatile with the versatile skill set and should be utilized as such, similar to what you see with Anthony Davis in L.A. Yes, he needs to improve certain aspects of his game, especially due to him being limited to three games this season. But from what I hear, his work ethic is no concern, so the improvement will come. With a player with Hall of Fame-level potential, you don't want to be the team known for passing on Wiseman down the line.